Tim and Brett here from Skillwork. In the video here today, we're going to talk to you about skill worker shortage in 2020. Automation and machine learning will continue to rise. Prior to Skillwork, I spent 30 years in the manufacturing space, and so this topic, you know, it was a reality that we lived in. And, and so automation has become, out of just pure necessity, something that manufacturing companies have gone to. You know, the uh, finding the, what we would refer to as a frontline worker. So, you know, finding those frontline workers, people that uh, would work on the lines, whether it be a, any type of manufacturing facility, you know, the, the ability to find uh, the number of people you needed was, was a growing concern. So one of the things that, that uh, you know, made a lot of sense in the boardroom was to say, you know, well, if we put in automation on this line, it'll, it will uh, eliminate the need for five or six, you know, frontline workers. And so it wasn't so much a need to eliminate those people. We weren't getting rid of people. They just weren't there. And so, so it truly was, was out of necessity that a lot of automation was being looked at to put into these different facilities. All seemed great on the surface. The, the, the challenge that it created was it, it drove demand for a much more uh, highly technical service technician. And these facilities in a lot of cases didn't have them. And so now you created a different issue that you had to find a solution to because you had spent millions of dollars in automation and, and robotics and these types of things with then a reality that um, we don't know how to keep this equipment running and, and we've got to find, now we have to find those individuals. Right, so uh, in an effort to try to solve their problem of a shrinking pool of skilled workers to keep their equipment running, they turn to automation technology, which is a good thing, helps industry become more efficient. But as you mentioned, now we got to find those, you know, very advanced skilled uh, technicians that may not be as readily available as they used to be in your local area, for, uh, for example. So that's again where we have been able to search across the country for the specific needs that you need to be able to address whatever automation or robotics that you're either uh, bringing on or considering bringing on. So again, we help solve that uh, growing challenge of finding the right people at the right time for what you need. No, that's, that's exactly correct. You know, as, as I talked about, you know, I had personal experience in it. You know, I have a, a friend in the industry as well, a very large organization. Companies that have that level of resource, you know, he, he shared with me specifically that they had invested millions and millions of dollars in, in automation. <laughs> right. And the reality was they had lines setting in the plants that they, they weren't running um, because of this issue. And so, you know, it's, it's a real issue um, to, to your point. I think it's, it's uh, it really uh, puts more emphasis on being able to find as you said, the right talent and get it to the right place at the right time, which, which at skill work, uh, we, we definitely believe that we can help you do that. Yeah, so I mean, the, the idea about investing your capital uh, into advancing technology is a great idea, but that comes with some other challenges that, that we can help you address as you move into 2020 and beyond.